Did you grow up thinking Greenland is almost the same size as Africa? Well, hate to break it to you, but every world map you've seen is wrong. And it's not your fault, it's the maps. The Earth is a sphere or close to it. But since we can't flatten a globe perfectly, cartographers have to project it onto a flat surface. That's where the distortion begins. Enter the Mercator projection, probably the most famous one. It was designed in the 1500s for navigation, not accuracy. It keeps shapes of countries mostly correct, but massively distorts their sizes. Take Greenland, for example. On the Mercator map, it looks almost as big as Africa, but in reality, Africa is about 14 times larger. Europe often appears bigger than South America, but again, that's an illusion. The closer a country is to the equator, the smaller it looks on this map. Meanwhile, places closer to the poles appear much larger than they actually are. There's also the Gall-Peters projection, which tries to fix the size problem. It represents countries in their correct proportions, but at the cost of distorting their shapes. Everything looks unusually tall and stretched. Each map projection tells a different story, highlighting some truths while hiding others, but none of them are perfect. So, why does this matter? Because maps shape the way we see the world. They influence who we think is important, who seems small, and what we perceive as central. When the map is biased, so is our perspective. If you found this surprising, remember to like, comment, and hit subscribe for more eye-opening geography facts. Because sometimes what you see isn't the whole picture.